Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Delhi Tarot and these are your monthly readings for the sun, moon and the rising sign of Virgo. Virgo, please keep in mind that this is your general reading for the month of December 2023. It's a group reading. So please pick it up what resonates with you. Please leave the rest for others. And if you really like what I do on the channel, please do like, subscribe the channel and put on the notifications. I don't know what is happening with your cards, Virgo. Uh, it is not allowing me to shuffle at all. And there is a very, very important message that don't take any major decision, any impulsive any ad hoc decision in the month of December, be aware, be cautious. It's a red flag. It's an alarming situation. The angels want you to wait. Have patience because things are little tied up. So I'll just come back to these cards in a minute. Let us see what fairy messages do we have for you. We have the card of vegetarian. We have a card of sun and we have emotional healing coming up. Okay, I'll pull the rest of the card a little later because this needs more attention. Things are little tied up and this is not about your own limitations, your own assumptions. There are blockages, there are challenges, there are hidden factors which are playing at its own, at your back and that is why I do feel there is little jealousy, animism, your time not correct for, uh, for you to expose your thought feeling or even to share your thought or feeling. It's the month for you to reserve, retain, Whatever you know, whatever information you have, whatever your plans are, your thought, your feeling, this is not the month because things will not go as per your plan in this month. Now, before I proceed forward, my apologies for beginning the reading with not so positive and good news. But you know very well, Virgo, for me being honest, being truthful, to my followers and subscriber is more important than any other thing. So I do feel that this, these are the external factors which are more powerful, which are holding your work in the form of obstacle challenges. You know, the moment you will see, oh, there is a moment, again, you will see a blockage. The moment you will try to take a step in step, again, there will be a blockage. So be patient this month. Don't be aggressive. Don't be impulsive. Don't fall into any conflict, argument, disagreement. You have to take a backseat from any such drama in this month. That is going to be in your favor absolutely. And the situation which says all tied up. Yes, don't start any new work or, a, or something which you are really waiting for very, very long this month. Because you will get less external support this month. Just pass on this month time coolly, calmly, peacefully, patiently and just see how the new year is going to support you very well. Yes, this month because of these challenges, you will see a lot of wisdom, a lot of maturity, a lot of experience coming to you. You will also see that how in your downtime, in your crisis, you are managing your self own. I don't see people coming forward to help you. You also have the master angel number five, five and seven here. So do remember to Google angel number five, five, seven. There is a message for you. This all experience in the month of December is absolutely going to give you a wisdom full experience and exposure. I do feel that you will stop depending on other people for your growth victory and you will regain, a, you know, unlimited uh, unexpected kind of self-confidence post the month of December because you know that if you want something in life you can only depend on yourself Virgo and yes being patient do not invest anything this month do not spend money in big purchases luxury and do not trust anybody don't lend money also don't take loan also and don't start anything during this month have space 
give space time energy to yourself and be patient with any major development now if i see your fairy messages the card of vegetarian says there will be a new way of eating which gives you more energy greater health clarity stronger manifestation abilities it's a sign symbol and indication that you need to pay attention to your eating schedule because you need to pay attention to your health this month that needs your attention and yes anything which you are doing with children any profession any job any career or if you are spending time voluntarily with children that is also going to help you out if you are facing any problem related to your children if there are any issues i am getting a very strong vibration that you will get support in that area of your life the card also says that your son is watched over and protected as he explores the world that means your kids your children if you are concerned about their safety and security they are absolutely fine now this is the most important card of your reading it says emotional healing as your heart heals of old emotional pain you receive new blessings and love i do feel there is a blockage in your heart chakra and you do need external healing support you can also do your healing self if you want i always tell you guys that there are a lot of youtube meditation you can start calling archangel michael archangel raphael but sometime when you're too down you need external support and if you need external support yes you know delhi tarot we do readings and we do healings but you need to clean up your heart chakra the moment your heart chakra is ready to explore and receive new people new love new opportunity you will see that there is a complete change over in your aura in your energies and things will start rolling up for you and things which you feel are all tied up will have a solution resolution and your favorable outcome now let us see what other angel message card do we have for my virgo people out there mm -hmm. it says i bring you a message from your deceased loved one now somebody specific needs to hear that if you are sensing someone deceased near you or if you are watching them over your dreams or if you are remembering them quite often than usual it says i bring you a message from your deceased one that i am happy at peace and i love you very much please don't worry about me somebody needs to hear this message that your deceased loved one is safe secure and they are sending love and blessings to you in your time and the other message is you are protected from all types of harm the worst is now behind you i asked you to relax and feel safe so this is all about being patient feeling relaxed and comfortable now let us see what messages do we have in the first 15 days of november december for you did i said november in the beginning if i did that my apologies and because cards were falling out immediately so i started doing your reading virgo okay you have page of cups in the first 15 days you have knight of pentacles and you have four of wands you have a brilliant tarot reading in the first 15 days of december let us see your second part of december you have the lovers and you have the high priestess now this is very important this is what needs patience this is what need not taking any major des decision or move the high priestess is a card is a situation which says that there is something very important hidden from you which will be unfolded or unrevealed to you in its due course of time because the universe want you to take that experience exposure while you walk through that experience so something important is going to get revealed by that time it encourages you to trust your intuition to trust your gut feeling and don't take any major decision by that time and your other card for part 2 oh my goodness your second part of december is too crucial because all our major arcana cards your december month is going to be a brilliant month in terms of a massive change coming to your life in the first 15 days you have knight of pentacle that means for money wise 
money, career, finances, you actually don't have to worry at all. Things will become stable. Money will stay with you. You will become extremely mature, sensible with the money in hand. However, the movement will happen on its own. You don't have to take any aggressive, impulsive decision or movement. You also have a page of cup which says that it is expected that if you are waiting for any phone call, any message, page of cup brings that message, that phone call to you that could be related to your personal life, that could be related to your professional life. Things will fall on its place in time to come. And four of wands says that there are great possibilities of marriage, reunion, you know, formal engagement. Plus, there is also a possibility that a partnership collaboration is being offered to you. Explore that. That is beautiful because that whatever association you are being offered, personal, professional in the month of December, allow it to happen because that is happening on its own. That is divine intervention. You are not taking any major decision. The offer is coming from the other side. But this offer is going to be long lasting. Is going to form a good base. And there is a very rock solid kind of foundation you will be building. Now your second part is very very interesting. Because you do have the major arcana cards. All three. The High Priestess, I have already told you that you need to wait for something to get unfolded. The Lover brings a lot of opportunities to you in love, in career, in professional life. So if you are looking for opportunities, yes, the Lover will bring a lot of opportunities to you. And the Death card says that the issues, challenges, delays, prolonged illness, every such situation will naturally come to an end. But the, when you have this death card in a reading, trust me, it gives a lot of emotional pain because this is not a small time investment. When I say investment, I do not mean money at all. I mean you have invested your soul, your blood, your life, your time, your space, your energy into something very dear to you. And that comes to an end with a huge pain. You know, you tried your level best. You went out of your limit. You went out of your boundaries to support a relationship, an engagement, an association. That is coming to an end. But this end is necessary for your growth, for your soul movement, not just your temporary movement, but your life movement is very, very important on which is based on this death card right at the moment. And that is why I told you that you can do your emotional healing, but I do feel I was not aware that we are going to get this death card because death brings unbearable kind of emotional pain. And this is a sign and a symbol that you need some support this particular month. And you can send a message to me in case you want to explore those options. Now let us see which angel therapy is going to be helpful for you in the month of December. And you do have, okay, you have two cards again here. The first one says workshop and seminars, attending and giving speeches, going as a panelist, expert, speaker, contributor, advisor, a coach, a mentor is something which is really fruitful for you this month. It says attending and giving speeches is a part of your spiritual path and purpose. Be open to teaching and learning. Oh my goodness. This is for the first time I have got the same card. Vegetarian and vegetarian. Two times vegetarian card. Same card in the same reading. It says fresh organic fruits and vegetables give you a boost of high life force energy. Which elevates your spiritual frequency. Excuse me for my throat. You need to give special attention to your diet. That is absolutely clear in the month of December. There's something related to your health for sure. Now let us see which crystal is going to be lucky for you. And what are your crystal messages? Let me pull out your card. And you have opal, a very popular crystal. Let yourself sparkle and shine. You're guided to be bold and show your bigger than life side to the world but you need to still wait don't do it ad hocly 
your second part of the month of December is pretty better than even the first part. You can sparkle, you can shine, but take little time in coming out. Come out, but with well thought idea and planning, which if something is sensitive, you need to retain it with yourself. Dear Virgo, this is a detailed reading for your month, December 2023. It's a group general reading. Please pick it up what resonates with you. Please leave the rest for others. And you know very well that in case you want to connect with me for a reading and there are healing messages which are coming in your reading time and again, you can drop me an email. You can discuss your options with me and accordingly you can proceed forward. Be blessed. I will see you next time very soon.